<laughs> hey, how's it going? It's uh, Mr. Whalen and the Tito, and this totally isn't our second take doing the voiceover because someone didn't just delete it. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let me try to remember what we went over. Oh. All right, something that I, I'd want to get across with this is that um, you know the the tier, you know the top tiers, everyone has fun with them. They're always quick, you know, good mix-ups and stuff like that. But I feel to get a better appreciation of at least game mechanics, you gotta try all different speed, you know, strength type of characters. Like working with Hagger and Hulk, you can't go really nuts. They're slow. The mobility is eh at best. They have a couple of tricks, you know, either armor or like lariat to help them out. But you really gotta learn to read your opponent. You can't just keep bulk canceling move after move until something hits. You know, they're not Uzis. They're shotguns. You have to <laughs> you have to get in close and do your damage. And, you know, if, if anything, you can take this away, at least in other games, too. You need to be able to read your opponent, whether it's Street Fighter, NPC 3 Soul Calibur, you know. In all these games, there's not a system that just supports you pressing as many buttons as you can and being bored. Yeah, trench coats. <laughs> that's, that's, that's not the point. I mean, basically, you're never going to become a better player. Online, yeah, you may seem like you're winning a lot, but unless you find a team that actually defines you the way that you like it, you know, you can use them offline, it's something that really matters. I mean, if you want to stay at home and be an online hero, I mean, do what you got to do. But, uh, I mean, like, don't, I mean, you won't end up using somebody like Viper. I'll tell you that much right now. Yeah, right online now, is really tough to use or execution exactly. wise. Somebody on my, my team as a middle person, you know, somebody's there supposed to use the meter and apply it in her game, which means she can't. She loses all the uh, effectiveness that uh, Viper should have online. And, uh,. Oh my god, I'm about to get in there with Ghost Rider right now. Just watch. <laughs> <laughs> I think I remember what our next point was gonna be. But let's just watch the view on this. Oh my goodness, you know what? Ghost this Rider Wild Swings. Favorite this video. Yeah, oh my after god. all this, the Ghost Rider, the hagger of, of zoning. We just keep <laughs> grabbing and whipping them around until you finally want to end it with a hyper. Exactly, I choose one. That was a yeah. DHC, by the way, for the kill. But, but yeah, online. Yeah. And I think right, now we just want to, you know, now we can just talk about the weather for a little bit, change the video, do yeah. whatever. Because I'm, I'm gonna lose this. I'm gonna spoil yeah. it for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna. I think that's gonna be a theme where we just, you know, we have to put in one video to where we pull off something nasty, and then out of nowhere we just have to mind ourselves, we have to pick up our drive and stuff like that. <laughs> Well, but, uh, I mean, I, I, really, I mean, just focus. I mean, look at look at how he's, you know, always pressing buttons. He does exactly yeah. what we're saying. Like, there's no smart play involved. And the funny thing is, is, like half of those moves either have startup invincibility or like EQ plus on block. Like it's it's ridiculous how much pressure they can keep just by hitting. Look at all those buttons. <laughs> None of these are really even hitting. That's just a shitload of chip too from just teleporting around. True. But uh, yeah, one of the you know. When you see an odd team out there, I'd say just give them respect. I mean, one of the first people I'll give a shout out to is the kid. I think it was the kid fifty seven. I came across him with a rocket raccoon, and I was trying to main him when I started this. And I just gave him huge props. He was he was whooping ass with him. And for online too, that's something great. I haven't really seen him pick him up since. If he's out there watching, I'd like to see him pick up that that RR. But it's just amazing that certain characters just really aren't applicable online. Some of them are great, like if you go up against a Deadpool with either drones or hidden missiles backing them up, you can't stop it, just between lag, you can't wave dash in at the right time, the screen's covered, offline that does not work. If you look at any tournaments too, there's, I don't really, do you know of any professional Deadpools, you just can't. Tatsu. Tatsu, well, yeah. But you'll never see him just jump back guns hiding behind drones and hidden missiles. Yeah. It's a very ineffective uh, habit to getting into, and it's just going to mess you up if you try playing offline, so... I mean, if, if you ever... <laughs> I'll explain that in a second. Go on. <laughs> if, you, if you ever really want to play this game offline and take it seriously, I would suggest, you know, dropping all those bad habits that you would normally apply online because they don't work. You know? Let me see if I can explain that one real quick. <laughs> see, the reason why I like going to player match instead of, uh, <laughs> instead of ranked is because you can get random out once in ranked. You know, someone will be doing teleport Vajras or something, you're not really used to it, and instead of getting to actually play that guy again and figure out, you know, a system or a way to beat it, you just have to hope to find him again. But, uh, that's why I like going to player. I found a guy that literally used all three trench coats, he used them pretty effectively, and I, I didn't even know about this round trip unblockable 
until I fought this guy. He just abused the hell out of it. And every time that arm was going, yeah. it was a trap. I just, no matter where I was, he just threw that, and I just prayed to God that I'd block the right way, and I just let Block Stun hold me in until I could figure out something. But yeah, just I honestly recommend you guys. It's cool to have a good rank and all. I'd say rank up until you're at a good, you know, difficulty setting with your opponents, but. If you're gonna hammer out your issues, you gotta do those rematches. It's all about the sets. Definitely. And this guy wants to get fans. Right. I mean, <laughs> he could have easily just won the match right there, but he was trying to go and build enough meter for another level three and get it with Dante. And try to be fancy. Tom may put the glasses back on. Yeah, all that stuff that turn <laughs> normally do. <sighs> I'm still trying to work on this setup where you put them in enough blocks done to get the grab afterwards. I still have not been able to pull it off. I'm loving the stare down. Not a single push block. No, no, no. It doesn't mean that you get so used to a certain habit. Like when you're online, you could just press buttons with Dante or with, you know, uh, Wesker or Virgil. But offline, it's not going to work. You forget about the, the actual parts of the system. You know, the air exchanges don't work offline. I'm sorry, they just don't. Those, uh, those faulty cross-ups that you have, <laughs> the, they just don't work. Yeah. You know, online, you could you press back when they, when they teleport to the other side, but it's going to take a little bit to register. It's actually going to work, and it's going to keep landing, and keep working online. But and As a side note, as we were reviewing this video, I noticed that he was using boulder assist with Tron, and the Sentinel spit broke it. Mm. And they're on the same team, so it's another Akuma Chris thing where they're... They're worst best friends. They're, they're frenemies. <laughs> One assist the, is beaten out by the point man. That, I'm not going to lie, though, that link is hard to do online. Because you have to hit it right on the second charge, and with flag, it's impossible. I do like how fancy we're with skipping everything with the animation of ground. Yeah, I mean, I think, I think the uh, Tron's little ball there disappears when she's getting hit anyway. But just in case, you know. Use the animations when you can, guys. Part of the mechanics of this game, one of the 18 million systems that I've got. Yeah, I just got lucky. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, I'm a servbot crying. <laughs> <laughs> I needed to post a victory after my. Uh, I've, I've been doing really bad lately. You know, I've just been caught up with other things out in real life and stuff, and not enough time to practice, not enough time to get better. So I apologize for that. Hopefully, we'll be able to get a better quality content to you guys soon. Um, in the meantime, though, keep watching our fraudulent victories. Hey, 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 hey. No, our fraudulent victories. <laughs> <laughs> I will not defend you. <laughs> okay, almost any win I get with Hulk. <laughs> <laughs> almost any win I get with Hulk is probably fraudulent. But Hagger, I... I, <laughs> I mean, you gotta love these guys. These big guys, they just keep on coming. You know, you don't really have to push block as much with them because the last thing you want is sent back you know, all that extra space and then being left at a frame disadvantage after block. You know, you're just going to sit there and eat the hits. And that's why uh, Adventure Time, I felt, really represents, you know, the pain I go through with some of my main guys in there. Or you just have to get your knees broken to still get in there and do some damage. <laughs> yeah. See, that was supposed to be the, that new clever cross under that's been catching on. In mid-screen, you can do the pipe medium, Wesker just avoids it because it's Wesker. But once in corner, you can get the uh, Violent Axe Light. It's very ambiguous. It's one of the very few shenanigans Hagger can have on incoming that will work. He doesn't have any tricky Dormammu beam, triple set, cross up, reset, cross up stuff going, but he's, he's got Violent Axe. <laughs> <laughs> and right here, once again, you get online bad habits again. Random hypers just don't work. Right, he could have at least command grabbed, did normal grab, did anything, you know? Yeah. And it's, it wasn't even a matter of being hard to do online. Uh, he was within range. Uh, he had the super freeze, the uh, hyper freeze. Yeah, I didn't even realize that, too. Like, I. Because I just. I used to use Hulk back in vanilla, but I, I had ADD in vanilla. I just tried as many characters as I could to see what would work with Hagger. And mm. in this game, I, I played a friend who used to main Hulk. So when I'd go up to him and I'd use that to try and make stuff safe. Just grab the hell out of me. All the rocks would go through the animation. I just didn't know it. It was, it was painful to learn the hard way, but I'm glad that, you know, certain people don't know. That's not fraudulent, right? No, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, here's our wrap up. We're putting the promo at the end, that way we don't get cut off like last episode. Yeah, no, feel free to exit if you want. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, on behalf of the two of us, I'd like to say thank you for 
the likes, the favorites, the subscriptions, the views. I mean, it helps keep us going. And granted, we're you know we work 40 plus hours a week, but we try to get this content out for you guys when we can. We appreciate the the SRK love, you know, comments. That's yeah, all. Yeah, comments, appreciate. feedback is very yeah. important, guys. I mean, we don't have that much time to to work on these, but uh, any feedback is definitely great. If yeah. we need to improve on something, feel free to say it. Don't worry about it. Be honest. Fighters helping fighters. Fighters helping fighters. <laughs> exactly what it is. And uh, you know the deal. Rate, comment, subscribe. And uh, we'll keep the work coming if you guys like it. You know. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, and uh, by the way, right. Eastman 945, ISMA 945, PSN ID. Fuck him up. He's free. Later. Yeah, buddy. <laughs>